Okay, so hello everyone, this is Lakshya here. Let's continue with today's GOGP registry. Uh, since the last two days, I was not able to upload any videos because I had a lot of interviews, even multiple interviews this month, and, uh, and have cracked some of them as well. So, decide to join March. So, okay, we'll try to stay consistent with you. But uh, doing the two things at the same time, sometimes there's a problem. Ho jata hai. Uh, today's question is again a recursive problem and I think yesterday's uh, before today's question was also a recursive and DP problem So let us read the today's question. We have been given a number and we have to break it uh, We have to break it into three parts and by two and by three and by four Each num and uh, one number of my okay, each number of 10 is process can be divided for the recursive wheel We need to get the maximum sum that can be obtained by some of the divided parts together There's also one note that it is possible that we do not Divide the number at all. ठीक है यार. तो इस note का ये मतलब है कि let's say we have uh, twelve, right? So twelve could be divided in three parts, right? So n by two, that is twelve by two, twelve by three, and twelve by four. So this will give you six. This will give you four, and this will give us three. If we sum it, it is it is thirteen, right? So the note says it is possible that we do not divide the number at all, right? मतलब कि हमारा इनिशियल नंबर 12 था एंड आफ्टर डिवाइडिंग वी गेट 13 तो इन दोनों में मैक्सिमम जो है मैं वो रिटर्न करना है अगर डिवीजन के बाद कोई ऐसा केस हो कि डिवीजन करने के बाद लेट्स से ये एक्स था लेट्स से ये 12 था राइट right? और हमारे पास कुछ लेस देन 12 आ जाए तो डेफिनेटली हम डिवीजन नहीं करेंगे और अपने नंबर को ही लेंगे सो so, इस नोट का ये मतलब है बट इन दिस केस वी हैव 13 हियर राइट सो वी विल डिवाइड इट देन वी विल रिकर्सिवली डिवाइड अगेन सो 6 बाय 2 6 बाय 3 and 6 by 4 which will give us which will give us as 3 then 1 wait a second hmm. so it will give us 3 2 and 1 similarly we'll divide 4 and upon division we will get the values as 2 1 1 i have written it i'm just copy and pasting it here so for 3 uh, we'll again 3 by 2 that is 1 3 by 3 that is 1 3 by 4 that is 0 right now if we see the base cases now whenever the number is one or zero like the base cases are where, where we hit the minimum point right so we have to check one if you try to divide one right so that is one by three which will give you zero one by two gives you zero one by four which gives you zero right so it is so inka jo division karne ke baad just sum aaya wo hai zero or number itself is pointing to one to hume maximum return karna right so if one hai to hume one hi return karna hai similarly agar zero hai so उसको भी डिवाइड करने से कुछ नहीं मिलने वाला है जीरो एंड जीरो ही मिलेगा तो उसके लिए जीरो रिटर्न करना तो बेस केस तो आप ये लिख सकते हो यार कि अगर नंबर इक्वल्स इक्वल्स टू 1 है और और इक्वल्स इक्वल्स टू 0 राइट देन इन दैट केस आई विल जस्ट से रिटर्न एन राइट इन रेस्ट ऑफ द केसेस आई विल मेक अ रिकर्सिव कॉल सो आई विल जस्ट कॉल फंक्शन ऑफ n by 3 uh function of n by 2 and function of n by 4 and what is the task the question was saying that upon division you get the sum of the branches, right? I, I need the sum of these three numbers upon division. Like in case of 12, I need the sum of 6, 4, 3. And uh, I need the sum and I, I need to compare with the given n, your current n, which you have made the division from. So I will I include a plus sign, right? And I will get the maximum out of it. So I will just call return maximum of the summation of these three functions, comma n. And I think this will serve a purpose, right? So, ये जो division से यार ये continue होंगे आगे two के लिए भी कुछ हमारा answer होगा one के लिए तो one ही होगा and everything. So that makes sense. So this would be our pseudo code and let us see the exact code in action as well. So we have a max sum function. So we we written the base case. Then we have a return math dot max. The first parameter is the all the three recursive calls in the summation form, and we compare it with the maximum or the current number. That is it. So let us see the code in action now. So here's the code for our brute force technique or the recursive approach and what would be the time and space complexity? The time complexity would be we are uh, making uh, three calls for an n, right? So for each and every n, n it has three branches. So I will say three exponent n, right? Similarly, what would be the time and space? It would be O of n, the height of the recursive, uh, the height of the recursive uh, recurrence tree, right? Great, how we can memorize this approach? Memorize this approach using the dynamic programming. So what are the states? Identify the states that are changing. So every time n is only changing, right? So we'll make a DP array of size n plus one. 
and uh, so for n equals to 0 and n equals to 1 we return n and so we will mark the dp of 0 as 0 dp of 1 as 1 and for rest of the cases we will just say dp of i is nothing but dp of i by 3 plus dp of i by 3 plus dp of i by 4 comma maximum with n maximum with i and that that is it please pause this video try to code this approach by yourself and then we can see the exact code in action so that's the memorization approach which i just explained to you how do we do it so again the base cases are there and we have we have marked the zero dp of zero with zero dp of one with one because for n equals to an answer would be zero and for n equals to one answer would be one similarly for rest of the cases we have a for loop going from two to less than n and we are just replicating whatever we have done using the recursive function instead of n that has changed to i and that's it we are returning the dp of n that would be it what would be the time and space quantity here we are iterating for n values right just once so it would be o of n and O of N as uh, space comes to you as well. So that is it for this today's question. Till then, keep learning, keep going, bye, and take care. If you like the video solution and problem, do like, share, and subscribe. And let us meet again in the next video. Till then, bye bye.